All right, so again, you know, um, yeah, that's that's what I think in, in my head. I don't say it, but I think in my head, I go, what the fuck is it your business of how I'm gonna earn money or what I'm gonna do, or what kind of job I'm gonna do, right? Um, <clears throat> I would never join the police. I'll tell you that right now. I would never join the police. I would never take an undercover position, you know? Um, I wouldn't get my hands dirty and deal with anything dirty because I don't wanna, you know, it's, it, it's hard, you know, you're that guy that everybody sees, you know, like if you see me, you know, you look at me and, and, and you're not gonna, you know, you, you, you know what I mean? I, I make an impression on people, you know what I mean? And I make a strong impression on people. So there's no way that I can get away with doing illegal shit. So I'm obviously not gonna do illegal shit. You know what I mean? Um, um, and, 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 and again, earning money is not a big deal at all. Even, even if you have to work an entry level job, right? Let's say you go out there and you can't get a job and you have to work an entry level job. You don't have to work it for that long. And allow me to explain. If you're very good at whatever you're doing, it shouldn't be that hard for you to rise. Let's say I rate myself very high, you know, oh man, I'm, 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 I think I'm very smart. I think I have survival skills. I think I'm very good, blah, 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 right? When it comes to earning money, I mean, even if I was to start with like a simple job, like, like, like a stupid job, I know that within, you know, a few months, I'll, get, I'll move on to something better and better and better and better. Should I have to do that? I'll be honest with you, it looks bad for a guy like me to do that because, you know, anyways, I don't want to get into that. You know, I don't, I don't care. I don't care about that shit, you know, but right now I don't have the capability. I don't have the allowance to be able to hold a job down. I don't even have like, like I, I'm, you know, I, I, I don't have the allowance to get a job right now. I should be able to have the allowance at some point in the near future. Right now, I don't have the allowance. So... I can't get a job right now. It's not fathomable. You know, it's, it's not possible. I can't fathom it. It's not possible. Not, you know, sometime in the near future, but not anytime soon. So that question should not even exist in my mind. I shouldn't even be thinking about that. You know what I mean? Oh, how am I going to earn money? Blah, blah, blah. I, I don't have, I, I can't work right now anyways. So when I can work, I have to find out what I'm going to do. But, you know, um, I mean, literally worst came to worst. Obviously, I would try to apply for good jobs and all that stuff. You know what I mean? Right now, I'll be honest with you. What I think, if I went and applied at like the shittiest clothing stores out there, they would never hire me. They wouldn't hire me anywhere. I couldn't get a job anywhere. Some stupid, dumb little fucking cunt of a kid is going to walk in and get the job that I'm supposed to get. And that's what they really want. I'm not stupid, man. You know, they want me to just, even if I can't work, they want me to send out applications so that some dumb motherfucker takes a position over me. And that's what it's really about. You know, they used to throw this at me that, that, that I was trying to be too much of a man and a tough guy and that I didn't know about, you know, you know, picking up girls and doing things like that. And, and, and that I wasn't, you know, and I, and I didn't know about money and stuff. And now they're like, why are you stealing everyone's girls? Oh, why are you looking at guys as girls? Or, or why are you, you know, and it's like, it's insane. It's like, dude, you know, you used to throw that in my face. And now you're saying, why are you like, you know, the, the, the player? Why are you such a player? You were throwing that in my face that I had no game. And when I went and learned game and got game, you're throwing that in my face saying you shouldn't be a player. You're a piece of shit. You're mean. You're horrible. You know, you take guys as girlfriends and things like that. Yeah, I mean, it's always getting thrown at me. Whatever I do and I achieve and I learn and, and I'm able to do, they always throw it at me, you know, and they look for something that I'm not good at to throw at me, which is this shit. It's absolutely ridiculous, you know. Why is that going on? Why is that being questioned? Oh, how are you going to earn? Why are you so concerned about that? And you're trying to set me up. By the way, I know they've been... Weeks, so many weeks ago it was, you know, I, I, I caught word that they were looking for an undercover in the area, and that I could apply for it. And I'm, I figured out pretty much that, you know, that they were gonna throw that job at me and give it to somebody else. You know what I mean? And I'm just like, dude, that's so fucking stupid. And I would never wanna work as undercover. I would never wanna work with the police, especially in North America, period. You know what I mean? But at the end of the day, it's like, 
listen, man, it's not that hard, man. You know what I mean? Over, you know, in, 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 it's, it's, it's not that difficult. There's people who do fuck all. There's people who stand at a door and say hi to people when they walk in. They call the doorman. You hold the door open for people and they put a hundred dollar cash tips in your pocket. You know, uh, 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 they say, all you do is say, hi, hello, sir. Hello, ma'am. And open doors for them and you get paid for it. There's like so many stupid fucking jobs out there. You stand in a convenience store which somebody else owns and people walk in, they pay for shit. They bring the shit to you. They pay for it. You, you just stand at the cash all day and you get paid for it. There's so many stupid fucking jobs out there. You know what I mean? This, this market is littered with stupid jobs. Anyone can make money. So I don't give a fuck about all that. And I, I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck about all that, man. I shouldn't even have to do that. I'm fucking OG status, man. Fucking rob the bank, man. Motherfucker, I shouldn't have to do shit like that, motherfucker. I, 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 I've been through way too much and I've done way too much even, even, even to have to do that shit. But like I said, at the end of the day, if, 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 you know, when the time comes, and I'm, and I have the ability to work or I have the ability to do business or I have the ability to earn money. Obviously, I'm going to go for the best thing that I can get. You know what I mean? And worst comes to worst, like, like on my worst day, if there was nothing but a kitchen job to cook, I would go work in a kitchen and cook because I know I don't have to do that forever. I can do that for a couple of months and I can go out to, you know, do some kind of, so, you know, I can go out and meet people and stuff and I can get word on another job to do. I can get word on something better to do, some, some other kind of business to get into. Worst comes to worst. Worst comes to worst, I can get a job in a kitchen, be cooking there for a couple of months, go out, talk to people and see what kind of opportunities there are and get an opportunity. I can get an opportunity to do something. I can find somebody who has a business and work in their business, you know, or, 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 or work with them or something. There, there's a million options out there. You know, worst comes to worst, even, even at the, like the worst comes to worst, go, go, go in the kitchen. I know how to cook, man. I can go to a kitchen. I can cook whatever the fuck I got to cook. I can do that for a couple of months. I, I know this is repetitive, but yeah, again, I can do that for a couple of months, get good at, and I got to repeat it so many times for it to get in, you know, but uh, I can do that for a couple of months while I'm out there making friends, you know, doing extracurricular activities out there, maybe going to bars, maybe meeting people, maybe just, maybe just, maybe just meeting people, uh, you know, in, in the mall or so, I don't know, wherever, you know what I mean? And, and when I'm done that, you know what I mean? I can, I can move up. I can become a chef or something, you know, a sous chef. It shouldn't be that. I can become a head chef in a year or something, man. It's not a big deal. You know what I mean? I know I can do it because I'm way faster and better than, than most people at learning things. It would take me six months to be at the level of a head chef. And it would probably take them one year to give me the a position of a head chef. So I'm not worried about any of that. I don't care. When I have the ability to do it, obviously I'm going to try to get the best thing I can. That That's just, that's, that's, you know, you know what I mean? I'll try to get the best thing I can. And if I can't get something, I get something else. And I get something else. And I get something else. I'll do something else. And I'll, and I'll stay afloat. That's all it is. It's not that fucking difficult, man. I did, I, I did a full-time shitty full-time valet job for like six months. Wasn't even that fucking hard. I, it wasn't hard at all. I, at all. I used to chill out all the time. I always had music in my ears. I was listening to music all the time. I was picking up girls. I was talking to girls on the phone. I used to talk to girls that I picked up on the phone when I was working, you know, I just, I, I, hey, what's it going? How's it going? I used to just talk to girls for hours and hours, man. Just to hang out, talk to the other guys that were working there, hang out, talk to the, to, to talk to people there, talk to the guests there. Hey, what's going on, man? Where, where are you coming from? What's, what's going on? You know, I, well, it was easy fucking shit. So I'm not worried about any of that. And, and the fact that now I can actually change and grow and I have changed and grown, it's not, it's not an issue for me. And I know that I don't have to stay in one place. Like I know that whatever I do, I'm only going to get better at it. I'm only going to move up. So I don't have any worries with that. And I'm done with this. And, and, and yeah, I, I, it was very repetitive. But sometimes you have to say things like a hundred times for people to understand. Anyways, I'm done.